my name is Harrison Davis, and with the help of Target Test Prep, I scored a 760 on the GMAT. I'll start off with just a little bit about my background. So for undergrad, I studied supply chain management out of BYU up in Utah. After graduating, I began working down here in Houston for Shell, where I'm currently a supply chain development lead. So I develop growth opportunities and projects to help support some of our downstream U.S. assets. I'll continue working full-time for Shell while kicking off my MBA on the weekends a few months from now out in Chicago. So if it's useful for anyone, I'll dive a bit into my MBA GMAT journey. Um, you know, to be honest, when I started seriously thinking about business school, I knew next to nothing about the GMAT. I was targeting an M7 school, and I knew that I probably needed a good GMAT score if I wanted to get into a school of that caliber, but that's honestly about all I knew. So without giving it much thought, I went onto Amazon and searched for a GMAT prep book. Um, I saw that the you know official GMAT prep book had some pretty good reviews, so I ordered a used copy and um, figured that was a good place to start. When the book came, I wanted to get an idea of where I was at as kind of a baseline. So I started out by taking the first diagnostic test. I ended up doing well on the verbal reasoning, but quickly realized that I needed to put in quite a bit of time on the quant, which honestly wasn't a surprise because the last time I took a math class was over five years ago. So was to be expected. Um, I kept working through that official GMAT prep book and, you know, I had a lot of good practice questions, but it didn't actually do much in terms of teaching the concepts. So after, say, a week or so, I abandoned that and started looking for a prep course that could specifically help me get my quant score up to where I needed it to be. I knew I would have, you know, around four months or so to study for the GMAT, primarily at nights while still working a demanding job, fulfilling family responsibilities and everything else that we all have going on. So I needed something I could do at my own pace and that would fit in with my own busy schedule. You know, with that in mind, I tried out a free version of several of the different options for prep courses out there, but I didn't really love any of them. I felt like they each had their clear strengths, but were clearly lacking in other areas. I really wanted something that laid out a clear path of what I needed to do in order to get the score I was looking for on the GMAT. While I was trying out all of these different offerings, I kept reading comments on forums that were talking about how great Target Test Prep was. So I decided to use their free trial and give it a try. You know, sure enough, within a few hours of using it, it became pretty clear that Target Test Prep was significantly better than the alternatives that I had tried. So I went ahead and signed up for a few month subscription and started getting to work. Fast forward a few months and I took the GMAT for the first time, scoring a 760. I can honestly say that the only reason I was able to score in that 99th percentile range on my first attempt was thanks to the effectiveness of target test prep. So let me take a minute and just you know dive into the details. Why do I think this program is so effective? First off, you start off the program by indicating your target GMAT score and then taking a diagnostic test to see where you're at in comparison to that score. Now, this isn't all that common. I noticed this on several of the prep courses that I was looking at, but what makes target test prep different is when you finish that test, you don't just get a list of questions you got right and wrong and a score. The program actually gives you a detailed breakdown of the type of questions you missed and how well you performed on individual categories alongside a bunch of other very useful data. So within you know, your first day of using target test prep, you already have a really good idea of what areas you need to focus on in order to improve your score. It saves you a lot of time. And then what's also great is Target Test Prep continues to track those same analytics as you progress through the program. So when it came time for me to review before actually taking the test, I knew exactly which areas I was solid on and which ones I needed to you know, spend a little extra time reviewing. Another thing I found really beneficial is how well-structured Target Test Prep is. Um, when I was getting going, like I said before, I really didn't know where to start in terms of studying. I really appreciated how Target Test Prep laid out a very clear, logical study plan that I could follow. On any given day, I never had to ask or wonder what I should study that day in order to prepare. Target Test Prep had the plan for me. All I had to do was click on the next lesson. That was really great. It saved me a lot of time, took out a lot of the, the guesswork, and really made my limited study time much more effective. Lastly, the instruction and explanation that Target Test Prep provides are phenomenal. 
They do a really great job of explaining concepts thoroughly, but without adding any excessive or unnecessary material. When I was going into this, I wasn't looking to become an expert and know every possible answer to any question that once in a blue moon might show up on the GMAT. I just wanted to get a good score that would get me into the schools I was looking at. You know, on, on kind of the flip side of things, I also wasn't looking for a program that just gave me a few tricks and gimmicks that may or may not actually work while taking the test. And Target Test Prep really delivered on this. They didn't give me the gimmicks. They didn't go into unnecessary detail. Their combination of text and video lessons really just explained what I needed to know in order to do really well on the test. So I'll get off the Target Test Prep fanboy section for a minute and just close off with a few pieces of advice for anyone currently studying the GMAT or thinking about taking the GMAT. Um, first, pick a plan and stick to it. I think it's kind of easy to drift from thing to thing when studying for a test like the GMAT. If you're on Einstein's level, I'm sure that could work for you, but for the rest of us, following a structured plan is really the only way to achieve one of these top scores. So, you know, it's obvious at this point, I'm a big believer in target test prep, but really regardless of what prep course you choose, don't waste months getting caught up in the paralysis by analysis. Spend some time to figure out what course is best for you and then go all in on it. Second, it probably sounds a little cliche, but set aside some dedicated time in your schedule for studying. Um, it's much harder to achieve the results you're looking for if you plan on studying just whenever you have a free minute or you know when the mood strikes you. So dedicate some time in your calendar and make it a habit to not skip those study sessions. Finally, don't forget about the rest of your MBA application. I think it's easy when you're in the GMAT study phase to just really hone in on that and forget about everything else you need to do in order to get into one of these MBA programs. Um, the GMAT is a very important piece of your applications, but it is just one piece. So even a perfect GMAT score could be overshadowed by mediocre essays or you know poor interview performance. If you're trying to hit a specific application window, I just say don't assume that you're going to be able to focus entirely on the GMAT until a week before the window closes, then hurry and scramble to figure out the rest of your application materials. The essays, the short answer questions, these things all take a lot of time, so plan accordingly. I'll end it here. I hope you found this useful. Best of luck to everyone on their GMAT journey, and don't forget to check out Target Test Prep.